hi guys welcome back to my channel today i'm gonna budget my youtube paycheck it's been a while since i budgeted it. oh my god it's been like forever but today i'm gonna budget out my paycheck that arrived on the 22nd we are on the 24th currently right now and i'm gonna go ahead and just budget it out right over here using my erin condren deluxe um, monthly planner new ones are coming out june 4th so if you want one just go ahead and wait a few more weeks they're coming trust me and i'm excited for them too i haven't i haven't been chosen to be a preview planner person but hey nonetheless i feel like i'm gonna go in store and look at them but if you want anything erin condren i do have affiliate links down below and of course don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you haven't already and let's get to it so we are gonna do my youtube paycheck which is my online income this is um done through google adsense if you are a youtuber and you have like i don't know more than four thousand or some type of views and you have more than a thousand subscribers you start getting paid for adsense which is basically the ads that you see on the channels depending on if people watch them if they skip them if they watch the entirety just that's what it's for so I'm going to go ahead and put Google AdSense because that is who is paying me. And just so you guys know, this is not taxed income. So I do have to take into account what is it that I need to pull out and um, make sure that um, my taxes are being pulled to the side because at the end of the year, I do not want to be owing anyone any money because we all know how they can be. The IRS is a pain in the ass. Okay, so let me go ahead and scroll to my transactions. So I was paid $398.09. That is what I made on YouTube. Let me zoom you guys in. Beautiful. So the first thing that I need to do is I need to take out 20%. So I'm going to go ahead and minus 20% for taxes. And usually I round this up. So if I do... 398.09 minus 20%, I'm gonna do $80. Let's do that. So if we do 398.09 minus $80, I have a total net of $318.09. This is all my revenue that I have. If it was for me, I would throw it at my debt snowball right now. But my current situation, I'm going to go ahead and throw it at savings. Usually you guys would know that I would throw easily $300 at my Victoria's Secret, which is my next debt. My Victoria's Secret, I believe it's City Card, and then so on and so forth. But right now I'm in a complete stop because I am on workers' comp. I'm on temporary disability. So we are just going to throw this at savings, and then we're going to focus on everything else later on. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. It's a really short video because I'm not using my debt snowball method anymore. Not at least until I'm back into my regular financial, you know, self stability or something like that. Anywho, this is what I made. Thank you guys so much. This is only possible because of you. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, you guys.